Hi guys, this is Kunal, your international grade expert. Welcome back to our channel JBS Academy, the go-to place for all your international grade knowledge. Today we have a fundamental topic that's crucial for anyone involved in global trade. That is how to calculate FOB price. Whether you are a seasoned importer, exporter, or just starting out, understanding the FOB price is essential. By the end of this video, you will be well equipped with the knowledge to make informed decisions and negotiate better deals. So let's dive in. For latest updates, subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon. First things first, what exactly is FOB? FOB stands for pre on board. We have already covered it in detail in another video. The link for the same would be in the description. FOB price consists of a lot of components. Now let's break down the components that make up the FOB price. First is product cost. This is the cost of the product itself. Then we have packaging and labeling. The expense of packaging and labeling the goods. Then we have local transportation. The cost to move goods to the departure port. Loading charges fees associated with loading the goods onto a vessel, export duties and taxes. The seller might have to cover these costs if applicable. Custom clearance, charges for custom paperwork processes, the cost of transportation to the goods to the port, freight to port cost and also the fees at the departure port called port handling charges. Documentation fees is also included. These are the documents related to the export. Now let's go through a practical example to illustrate this. We are going to export 100 home decor items from India to Canada. So let's assume the price of per item is $5 and we have 100 items. So that cost is $500. Then the packaging cost is $50. Local transportation $200. Loading charges $100. Export duties and taxes if applicable currently we are considering $0. Custom clearance charge $150. Freight to port charges $300, port handling charges $50, documentation fees $300. Now let's add this all up. So we get the FOB price of. Here are the few negotiation tips to help you get the best FOB price. First is research. Know the market and typical FOB price for your product. Second, build relationships. Strong relationships with the suppliers and buyers can lead to better terms then we have is leverage volume what i mean by it is bigger orders may get you better prices then we have quality versus price don't compromise quality for lower prices after all we need a good quality product and that's how you calculate fob price in international trade it's all about understanding the components doing your math and negotiating wisely by mastering these crucial aspect of international trade you will be well on your way to be successful and cost effective importer or exporter well guys that's all for today's video this is kunal your international trade expert if you like this video do give it a thumbs up share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe our channel for more such insights for detailed learning of all logistics subjects visit www.logivader.com